Hey everyone, so in today's video I'm going to show you how you can buy Bitcoin or alternative coins in Canada uh, through this website. Now this isn't the only way to buy Bitcoin or alternative coins in Canada. There are definitely other ways but this is just one of the ways and it's through this website called Coinberry. Now what I like about this website is that you can go from money in your bank account to having the coins with Coinberry all within a matter of minutes. So in this video I'm going to show you how to number one sign up, two fund your account, and three how to buy the coins. And so after watching this video you should be able to understand how to do it. So if you're interested stick around. So what you want to do is when you go to Coinberry you want to click on sign up as you see here. So once you click on sign up you'll enter your email address, you'll un enter a password, and if you're interested in a uh, $20 credit after you buy $50 worth of cryptocurrency, enter this referral code here. It's my referral code and I will get a cut from uh, from uh, I guess referring. Uh, so, but you'll also get the 20 bucks after uh, after purchasing $50 worth of cryptocurrency. Now if you're not interested in an extra $20 in in uh, in credit then don't use this referral link and just create the account with none. Uh, but yeah after you create the account it will send you an email to verify your email address and then once you've done that you'll be directed to a page where you have to verify your identity basically give your name your date of birth and where you live and so that pretty much you can get started in under 60 seconds just as it says here so once you've done that you'll be brought to a page that looks like this and it's the dashboard so for myself I currently have some money in and some ethereum here and uh, on this dashboard you can see what the market value of each coin is so example for Bitcoin it's eleven thousand 364 and uh, yeah just as I said they offer a few other cryptocurrencies just uh, or alternative coins so once you are here what you're going to do is click on fund now I've already got some money in here but uh, I'm just going to show you how you would do it or go about I personally stick with just e-transfers I've never done it through wire transfer or credit card so I'm just going to show you how I do it. So once you click on e-transfer, it's going to ask you to send an e-transfer to an email address. And then in your e email or your e-transfer, you're going to have to include a message. So this is my message that I have to include. Yours will be different or it should be different. So whatever message that you have, you have to include that into your email or e-transfer. Uh, for myself, it doesn't take too long to fund. For yourself, it might take up to 30 minutes. So it depends on your financial institution. So then once you have some money in your account, what you're going to do is just go to buy slash sell. And then you're going to click on the coin of your choice. So let's just say I want to continue buying Ethereum as I've already got some there. So I'll click on Ethereum and I'll buy, let's just say $10, right? So I want to buy $10 worth and I'll click next and then I'll choose from the 130 that I've already got with them so I'll click that and it'll tell you your order preview so it tells you how much you're buying it at and for how much or how much worth and that's what you'll get and yeah and I'll click buy now All right so as you can see it hasn't changed yet but I after I click on proceed to dashboard it will have changed. As you can see it's 120 now and my Ethereum balance has increased. So that's pretty much the way you would buy uh, cryptocurrencies in Canada. Now if you are wanting to sell them what you would do is just go back to here where it says buy slash sell and you would click on sell and then choose the coin that you want to sell I guess. So in my case let's just say Ethereum enter the amount that I want to sell and it'll show me a preview order or order preview and then so on and so forth so that's how you would buy and sell cryptocurrencies in um, with coins
Coinberry. So, but the main point with Coinberry is being able to buy cryptocurrencies uh, from money in your bank account to having the coins on Coinberry. So that's pretty much it. And if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up or leave a comment down below. And I, I really appreciate you watching. And also, if you're interested in getting notifications of my future videos, then please hit that subscribe button. But other than that, thanks for watching and uh, bye for now.